Hey, come on! What the hell is this? All you have to do is look at the scene to know that the killer never actually went inside the trash room. The shards of broken glass, the incinerator left running, the piece of shirt that escaped the fire. If the killer had been on cleaning duty, the evidence would have been taken care of much more thoroughly. Wait, wait, no, just hold on. But the distance from the gate to the incinerator has to be at least... 30 feet, right? The pinpoint accuracy you'd need to throw a glass ball that far and hit something that small. Could someone really do that? that that's right! There's no way! It'd be impossible! Difficult? Absolutely. Impossible? I don't think so. <laughs> the ultimate <laughs> baseball player. The ultimate baseball star! The killer is the ultimate baseball star! Isn't that right, Leon? Do you have any idea how stupid you sound right now? Greg! What's up, buddy? A target 30 feet away would surely be little challenge for the ultimate baseball star. You can't, you can't be serious. I'm not the killer! What's up, Greg? How you doing, buddy? These goddamn shipper brains have got it all wrong, I'm telling you! You still won't admit it? Okay, then. Makoto, go ahead and review the incident one more time to make this crime perfect. Greg, you put the pickle first and then Zeke first. Now here's what happened. Every case has one last element to bring the class trial to end. This is the closing argument. In this phase, you'll give a complete summary of the case. You'll have to re reproduce the flow of the events for the case in the form of a comic book. However, you'll notice that in the comic there are a number of pieces missing. It's up to you to complete the comic using the provided panels. Exactly. Also, if you take aim at a missing section and press A button, holy cow, you'll get a hint at what may lead to a breakthrough. Well then, good luck and have fun. Good luck, have fun. I said climax. Um, okay, so we start, oh, we're going right to left, so. No, that can't be it. We need the screwdriver one. Put there. And this goes there. And then cleaned up. Oh no. That goes here. That goes here. The killer is you. That BD was a buddy.
Greg Dong, how you guys doing today? Did I forget one? So, okay, so I have one extra one. I mean, I fuck you, Richie. I mean, that's what counts, right? Oh, that's what it was. Oh my God, that's idiotic. Exactly what happened. Richie, Rich, you sexy fuck. What should I post first and then your feet? Sure. Sure, Dong. Fuck me harder than Bid. <laughs> exactly. Finding herself cornered. panicked and ran into the bathroom. I just but I do it way more sexy than Big Ben. And I do it with consent, Richie. The killer went after her, but couldn't get the bathroom door open. What they didn't know was that my bathroom door got stuck in time. And there was a trick to open it. Sayaka knew about that because I told him. But of course, the killer had no way of knowing. So instead, Twice. <laughs> the forced the door open, took the kitchen knife. Ka ching And stabbed Sayaka. Yeah, that's not going to happen. I haven't watched the Kansas City game in a while. With Sayaka dead, the killer quickly began destroying the evidence. First, they took off their shirt, which was covered in their victim's blood. Then they took the lint roller in my room. I haven't watched any Buffalo area. games either. So, yeah. They wanted to make sure they got rid of any trace that had ever been there. Yeah, well, he's got a giant arm. A giant arm. They tried to burn the shirt using the incinerator there, but the trash room was blocked off by an especially sturdy gate, preventing access to the incinerator. So they came up with a plan. I do. I mean, it's not giant. It's pretty adequate, though. It's, it's bigger than normal. We'll put it that way. It's not porn star big, though. The killer managed to throw the ball through the gap in the gate. Incinerator switch. For any normal person, that'd be an impossible throw. But the killer had the confidence to take a shot, and that's because the killer was the ultimate baseball star. I mean, Aaron Rodgers is pretty good. The crystal ball, thrown with absolute precision, hit the switch on the incinerator, which then quickly roared to life. Yeah, he's kind of a dick, Richie, but no one looks sexier than you with a mustache, deputy. Simply considerably above average that works too like but i'm not gonna roast split anybody in half but i'm happy with what i have believe me you went there to try and wash the blood out of your shirt and that's where you saw it right seeing the ball you thought of a way to take care of everything i mean that also deputy oh, do you object to anything that's been 
myself. Do I object? Hell yes, I object. Of course I do. I object, I object, I object. I mean, all of this is just a bunch of stupid theories. Aw, Dong, I love you too. Mostly Gizmo. Fuck Rod Johnson, but Gizmo's pretty cool. I'm surprised you don't have one of those shirts yet, Deputy Dong. Sometimes during class trial, your opponent simply won't want to hear what you have to say. When this happens, you have to gauge them in a head-to-head -head battle. You like to refer to this as the bolt time battle, aka the BTB BTW. What? During the one to destroy your opponent's statements in time with the rhythm. What? Match your button presses with a tempo marker as they move across the screen and reach the center. I, this is a rhythm game. No. No. Oh no. This seems like it takes coordination. Why is there so many? But what's the way that to do with the A? I'm so confused. When the killer removed the screws from the doorknob, they didn't use anything from your room to do it. Instead, they must have used something that belonged to them. I refuse to acknowledge you. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Okay. I don't know. Where's your proof? You hit me? Not a chance. Get this. Stop talking. Shut up. Ah! I don't understand this. I don't. I real. No. Really? I refuse to give up yet. Yeah, I know. It's. I think it's just Where's your proof? You kidding me? Not a chance. It wasn't me. Stupid. You lost. Stop talking. Shut up. Here's your proof. You kidding me? Not a chance. You lost. Shut up. Here's your proof. You can't be. Not a chance. It wasn't me. Stupid. You lost. Stop talking. Shut up. Here's your proof. What? What is going on? doing I'm comboing when do I select the statements I refuse to give up yet. I'm trying to combo harder how do I select the statements with a Instead, I refuse to give up yet. 
Can't even go much longer. I refuse to give up yet. So do I have to wait till it, it like it's like highlighted before I hit A? Okay, got it. Where's your proof? This should prove it. Oh my god. That actually makes zero sense. The screws on the bathroom doorknob were removed. I wonder what kind of tool the kill I mean, it had to be a screwdriver, right? Oh yeah. I'm pretty sure the toolkits we got each had the proof. What he used. But the toolkit in my room. That's because the culprit didn't know it was your room. Only the fools got toolkit. Okay, then who's to stupid, stupid, stupid. It had to be your very stupid, stupid, stupid. Leon, would you mind showing us your toolkit? The screwdriver will show some stupid, stupid. And if you say you used it for something else, you'll have to explain exactly. And let me say this right now. I lost it isn't an excuse at this point. Stupid. There you so, go. You have no rebuttal? Then it would seem we are finished here. I mean, you have to feel bad for him because it wasn't his fault. Like, I mean, he it was his fault he killed her, but. <laughs> I got a C in the. 69, giggity. <laughs> Looks like you've reached your verdict. Then are we ready to cast our vote? Very nice. You all have a lever in front of you. Oh, just to make triple sure you vote for someone. You wouldn't Okay, then who will be chosen as the blackened? Will you make the right choice? What's it gonna be? What? Okay, we gotta hurry up because I gotta get out of here. Vote. Thanks, Dong. I love you, too. Uh-oh. Uh 
it looks like you got it right on the money. The black in the case, the one that that killed Saya Sayaka, was none other than Leon Kuwata. Of course I do, deputy. Huh? Hold on a second. Leon. Leon, did you really kill Sayaka? I don't believe it. Son of a bitch. What the hell's wrong with you? I, I, didn't, I didn't have a choice. It was kill or be killed. So that's, so, so that's why. I killed her first. None of you are any, you are any different. One step wrong, and you'd be the one standing here. It was complete chance that I wound up like this. I was just... Unlucky. That's all. Sure. Hey, come on. You expect me to accept my death? Everything's become clear. This decision we made was right after all. But when I think about that, honestly, I'd be better off if we'd been wrong. Because if we came up with with really is the truth, then the truth is that Sayaka was trying to frame me. But even if that's the true, I can't say she was wrong. After all, the mastermind. All because of that video. Even I couldn't handle what I saw in there. If I was her and the video actually had something to do with me, I can't even imagine. Now we're trapped here with no way out. They're probably waiting for me. Can't afford to be stuck in here. The one thing that was more important to her than anything else, her dreams, her friends. To have to, have to see something like that happen to them in Sayaka. I did whatever it took to reach that dream. I mean it, even some things that weren't so pleasant. She sucked a lot of dick. And that's why Sayaka, for the friends that meant so much to her, that's why she betrayed me. So, when she said, no matter what, no matter what happens, please be always be there for me. I need you on my side. She was lying to me from the very beginning. She was using me. Is that why she talked to me in the first place? I, I guess I'll never know because there's nothing I could do to ask what she was thinking. Once you're dead, that's that. <laughs> Boy, howdy. The entertainment industry must sure be terrifying, huh? I mean, try and kill someone just because of those relationships. She seemed to be so nice and lovely on the outside, but inside, she descended to pure madness. What What do you say? I understand. I really do. Yep, yep. You're in utter despair thanks to Sayaka's betrayal, right? Compassion, intimacy, love. The stronger those feelings, the stronger the despair when they collapse. Stop screwing with us. This is all your fault. Sayaka forced, being forced to do something like that. All of it, everything. It's all your fault. Suddenly and frenzy, I lunged at Monokuma, but that's enough. that's enough. As angry as it was, Kayoko latched onto my arm without hesitation. Her grip was like iron, strong enough I was sure it would leave a bruise. Calm down. If you really want to make her enemies pay for what they've done, you need to let her go, let it go for now. Damn it. Ah, that was a close one. I thought for sure you were going to give me a good walloping. Just barely avoid a punishment, you did. Yes, now then, since you so magnificently revealed the identity of the killer during the class trial, the Black and Leon Kuwata will receive his punishment. Pun punishment? Put punishment? You mean... You mean... I, Wait a second. I didn't have a choice. I had to kill her. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's it. it. I was protecting myself in the heat of the moment. It was self-defense. Okay? How exactly was it self-defense? When you forced your way into the bathroom, did you or did you not use your very own tool clip? After she shut herself in the bathroom, you went out of your way to head back to your own room. Then you came all the way back, broke into the bathroom and killed her. Am I wrong? You had any number of chances to stop without what you were doing, but yet you, you chose not to. Isn't that because you had an unclouded intent to commit murder? No, no, that's not. Stop it. I've had enough of this. Oh, are you sure? You were closer than anyone, were you not? You killed her, your precious Sayaka. Do you understand? I can't say Le Leon is solely to blame. Of course, I didn't plan on blaming Sayaka either. Because. Because the one to blame is him. Swa? If it weren't for you, this would never have happened to Sayaka or Leon. We shouldn't be fighting each other. We should be fighting against the one who has put us in this situation, the mastermind. Uh-oh, did you awaken your sense of justice? Well, it just so happens that there's nothing more unethical than an unwavering sense of justice. After all, it's people with that sort of mentality that perpetuate war all over the world. Is that some kind of justice you're waking within you? Just shut up! Okay, well, anyway, more importantly, let's hurry up and get to what everyone's been waiting for, the punishment. I'm begging you. No more begging, no more excuses. You must pay the penalty for breaking the rules. Society demands it.
the ultimate baseball star. Punishment time! Leanne has been found guilty. Time for the punishment. These are all really fucked up. Like a baseball machine gun. Ah, this would suck. Right in the balls repeatedly. Ah! Doesn't seem like my favorite way to go. You be dead. You be dead. What we saw, that was the true face of despair. I mean, if we can't call it that, what else could we call it? Extreme! Woohoo, extreme! Man, my adrenaline is pumping right out of control. Wah, wah! Uh, what's going on? I, I can't take this anymore. Do we really need to keep doing this? I just can't take it. Well, well hey, if you don't like it. All you got to do is swear to cut all ties with the outside world and accept living here forever. But that's only if every single one of you can get on board with that. Man, fuck you. Why the fuck are you doing all this evil shit to us? Evil. You make it sound like I'm some dark, awful, secret society type of guy. Or in this case, a dark, awful, secret society type of bear. Um, so why are you putting us, putting an understanding young, uh, under, upstanding young citizen like me through such a grueling ordeal? It seems like you're trying to use common sense to make sense of something that doesn't make sense. That's like trying to put us mile on a scale. I just don't think it's possible. Hey, uh, I don't think you, what you're saying and what I'm saying quite fit together. You piece of shit. I don't know who you are, but I'm gonna pound your ass into the ground. But ooh, you really must hate me to get so angry, huh? But if you do that, you're breaking way, you're barking way up the wrong tree. What happened? What happened? Because more than one of you decided you wanted to get out, right? No matter how much time passes, you can't cut free of your regrets from the outside world. You're to blame. Of course we can't cut, cut free of the outside world, being trapped in this insane place. Mm, you're trapped, are you? Well, I'm sure you learn all the mysteries of this school you're thinking will change for sure they'll think boy isn't it so wonderful how we get to live here forever what are you trying to say hey i feel like there's some deeper meaning hidden in there just like before anyway let's, let's get to the black and punishment that's what everyone is waiting for after all hey you say everyone who exactly are you referring to <laughs> sorry i said everything i've got to say i need to save someone for the fun for later ha <laughs> Jesus Christ, just like that, he was gone. He left us there overwhelmed by nightmare turned reality. Jesus, man. Even after he was gone, we stood there forever, unable to move. Actually, no, it wasn't that long, I think. Everyone just lost their sense of time. We were all too scared. Scared of being alone. Holy shit, can I save it? No one ever tried to speak. Their faces were stoned, their voices dead. But it was in that moment. Just a second. Mikado, can I talk to you for a second? She moved in close and whispered into my ear. Makoto. Before we head back, there's something I had to want to talk to you about. It's about the Sayaka, isn't it? I'm surprised you figured it out. Listen. I told you before the class trial started. You had to figure out the mystery of this case yourself. 
You wanted me to realize how Sayaka betrayed me by myself, didn't you? That thought never even crossed my mind. I feel like such a fool, becoming such an easy target like that. It's true. Sayaka meant to double cross you. That's a fact that you could that you can never change. But even until the very end, she wasn't sure of her decision. That's why, as she was late dying, she was thinking of you. She was thinking of me. You can't just say something like that. I mean, there's no way you know that. Only Sayaka would know for sure, and we can't ask her now. However, even if you ask her, you can infer it, don't you think? Her final thought is how she could protect you. What? So... The fact that she used her last ounce of energy to leave her dying message proves it. If she didn't care what happened to you, she never would have left that message. Well, maybe she wanted to get back at the person who had killed her. Certainly. That's certainly only one possibility, but I don't think that what it was. Anyway. She was uncertain. She wasn't sure she could kill someone or deceive you, which is why you, her plan failed. Her hesitation attracted failure. Right. It's almost ironic when you think about it. Why are you telling me all this? Because you're the kind of person who can overcome this. Because you can move past the deaths of your friends. Sayaka and Leon keep moving forward. Correct. Yeah, they did. Without someone like that, the others would never be able to break free of such a desperate situation. Move past their deaths? That's, I could never do that. No. I'm going to carry this with me the rest of my life. How could I possibly move past something like that? Leon Sayaka, I'll carry them with me forever. I'll carry their memories with me wherever I go. So instead of forgetting them, you're choosing the hard road. <laughs> well, I have high expectations for you. As she said that, she revealed a small smile. Hey. By the way, I have to admit, I'm curious. How did you know I wanted to talk to you about Sayaka? Oh, well. I'm psychic. What? Huh? Kidding. I just have pretty good intuition. That's pretty cool. Chapter one. To survive. Sweet! Okay, we can save it, and we're good. To be continued. I save it and go see what we're gonna raid. I literally is starting a podcast in like ten minutes. Okay. 